like, don't be a bitch, work as hard as you can. And no one gives a f if you don't have enough money, nobody gives a f if you're hungry, nobody gives a f if you're tired. You're the only one that can fix that. Dude, this is all I fing have right now. I'm like, I gotta make this so I can make my fing wife's life better, so I can do what I want. Like, this is, I have to do this. 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 Rich side, K9. Coming to you with a Doberman Pinscher, Mr. Niles and his owner. Niles is an incredibly aggressive Doberman. He's probably one of the last of a dying breed of true uh, working Doberman. Very athletic, very strong, and can be very, very, very aggressive. So we're working with Niles, doing everything we can to help him. I really commend this owner's dedication to this dog and dedication to making this situation work. Niles has attacked multiple dogs. Niles has bitten this owner multiple times as a matter of fact her daughter actually broke her hand breaking up a dog fight with his dog short of that i love niles i think niles is fantastic yes niles is on a pinch collar yes niles is on an e-collar yes niles is on a flat collar and um again i commend this owner she has no fear there's no danger of a dog fight right now but there's very high potential of her getting bit doing this so right now we are working on deconditioning fence aggression with this dog she lives in a very urban environment he will jump over the fence, go through a fence to engage a dog. So we're throwing him into the deep end, forcing him to go face to face with dogs, forcing him to walk past these fences with other dogs and just really conditioning. Listen, bud, just relax. You don't have to fence fight. You don't have to bite anything and we're going to reward you. However, on the flip side of that, there is corrections involved should aggression indoor dangerous behavior present itself. So again, this is not magic. This is repetition, repetition, repetition with absolute consistency, with consequences, with boundaries, and with a whole lot of reward. And I can't say enough again in closing with this owner. She is in this. She has jumped in both feet. She is working around the clock. She has committed to this dog. She's committed to the process. This is not your normal Doberman. This is this dog actually has a lot of potential in sport protection, things of this nature. Um, it's just, you know, most Dobermans nowadays are not this drivey. Again, right here, we're finishing up totally off leash, under control. Yes, Niles did train at Richside K9, but the training continues. If we can help you with your dog or anything you're seeing here, give us a call. Richside K9.